Hi there, my name is Blue Jay Robinson, I'm with Correlated Solutions, and today I'll be talking to you about lens care and contaminants. Uh, so here we have two cameras set up in stereo with a live image of Big Snap over my shoulder. Um, one of my lenses has a contaminant on it. Um, one way that you can test to see if you have a contaminant on your lens uh, is to do a visual inspection. Uh, look at both sides of the lens, and I, I know that since I have a contaminant on my one lens here, um, one way to see that it's on the lens itself opposed to the camera sensor or the computer screen or my uh, sample is just to rotate the lens. And as I rotate the lens, I can see that the contaminant is rotating at approximately the same rate of speed. So that's a very good indicator. Uh, one thing that you need to check or to make sure that you have uh, before you perform this test is that your aperture is somewhat closed. Um, I'm using 28 millimeter lenses right now with a, an f-stop of 8. Uh, so as I actually open up my aperture and allow in more light, um, I'm decreasing my depth of field and it's moving further away from the camera. So what this means is that everything in front of that depth of field is becoming more blurry, which essentially uh, is blurring out the contaminant to the point of non-visibility. Um, so one way uh, to get rid of the contaminants on the lens after you do realize that they're there is you first want to use a can of compressed air. And start off of the, the lens and blow on it and do that for both sides. Just like that. Uh, you want to make sure to uh, not blow on the lens uh, or to use a line hose because you might introduce other contaminants such as uh, oils. Um, and if you see anything like uh, fingerprints or smudges you can just make sure to use a cleaning cloth, cloth uh, made specifically for lenses and just wipe off both sides um, very well. Uh, so if you perform these tests and you know you clean your lenses and you find that you're still getting some odd strain measurement values or even uh, shade measurement values, uh, you might have a contaminant on the glass filter of the camera or either the camera sensor itself. Um, if it's dust on uh, the camera's filter, then you can just blow it off with a can of air. But if there's a smudge or a fingerprint, um, you'll probably want to send the camera back to us um, here at Correlated, and we can just clean that off for you. Um, and we can also clean off the, any dust or any fingerprint that uh, might be on the camera sensor itself. Um, we, we'd much prefer that than, than having you do it yourself. Uh, so if you have any questions about uh, lens care in general or contaminants, uh, please feel free to contact support at correlatedsolutions.com, um, and we look forward to hearing from you. Thanks.